Leadership is yeah. about thinking and doing. <coughs> Here I will find it. And I tell you, we are going to establish the committee here of those presenters. Consider yourself as members of the committee. Coordinating with the Ministry of Affairs. I will be talking to all the governors. The first will be ready to apply to acquire land. Your next doctors are busy, gainfully employed. The private sector, the education opportunity for the others and the family, the children, the medical care that will be established through that is a life saving opportunity. The whole issue of livestock reform is not for one particular ethnic nationality. It's not for particular religion. It's not for particular geopolitical zone, but it's for all Nigerians. Because it has two major components. First, the issue of economy. And secondly, the issue of security. Due to changing climatic situation, increase in population, creation because of technology, the farmer now doesn't require the manure from the cow because there is a synthetic fertilizer. While the husband has not, is not in position to get a new version of graze, of grazing, that is the grasses he is still using the natural grasses. These are issues that we need to resolve in our new reformed agenda. We need to also consider those who are into cattle business in the traditional format are also human beings. They need to be addressed. But the panacea is we need to migrate, transist from this migratory tendency to you know, ranching, mini ranching that support system can, can address.